Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell the solution of 10th problem from exercise 8.1 from quadrilaterals chapter from NCRT class 9. In this problem ABCD is a parallelogram and AP and CQ are perpendiculars from vertices A and C on diagonal BD. So here ABCD is a parallelogram. Parallelogram means opposite sides are parallel and equal. And here AP and CQ are perpendiculars on diagonal BD. So these two angles are 90 degrees and now we have to show that first one triangle APB this triangle is congruent to triangle CQD this triangle and second one we have to prove that AP is equal to CQ so this length is equal to CQ this length now we have to congruent these two triangles so mark the corresponding equal parts of these two triangles so here uh, we know that these two angles are 90 degrees because these two lengths are perpendiculars and again if you observe here these two angles are alternative interior angles because these two lines are uh, parallel because this is a parallelogram so these two are equal and again AB is equal to DC because this is a parallelogram opposite sides are equal so we can use AAS congruence rule here so take these two triangles first in triangle APB and triangle CQD angle APB is equal to angle CQD that is 90 degrees given and AB is parallel to CD and BD is a transversal line so these two angles are alternative interior angles those are equal we know that if a transversal line intersects two parallel lines then alternative interior angles are equal so angle ABP is equal to angle CDQ and now AB is equal to DC because in a parallelogram opposite sides are equal. So right here. So we can uh, congruent these two triangles. Triangle APB is congruent to triangle CQD by AAS congruence rule. Because here angle angle side of this triangle are equal to corresponding angle angle side of this triangle. Once these two triangles are congruent, we can equal the corresponding parts of these two triangles. So here we have to show that AP is equal to CQ. So these two are sides of these two triangles. So we can equal these two sides. Therefore, AP is equal to CQ by CPCT. Now, please do this exercise. These are the answers.